Yeah, I think I think you always uh, want to have a sense of who you are uh, leading into the opener. Um, we were, you know, I think we were evolving later than you know we have been in years past uh, because of some of the distractions. But I think I've got a pretty good sense and feel for who we are. Um, strong leadership. Um, I think we have young players that are going to contribute. Uh, this is going to be a long year, one that's going to require a lot of players to be actively involved in what we're doing. So I think we see uh, a group that has a lot of experience coming back, but that you're going to see some young players, um, you know, uh, be part of this as well. Um, I think defensively, uh, I think I mentioned this, I, I like uh, the athleticism and the speed. And then from uh, an offensive standpoint, um, you know, the physicality, especially, you know, when we, we deal with, uh, you know, the, the group that we have coming back on the offensive line. Our next question is from Tim Priester of Irish Illustrated. In December, you hinted that as good as your 2019 team was, your 2020 team could be even better. After what you've experienced with your team the last six months, including the last month or so on the field, how good is this team and what is this team's ceiling? Yeah, th those were December platitudes uh, after, after an 11-win season and knowing that we had plenty of time before. Uh, and Tim, you know that. Um, yeah, I mean, I, I, there's a lot of things to like about, you know, when you look at the basic tenets of your football team, right? The ability to run the football, uh, to have a veteran quarterback uh, back, um, certainly from a defensive structure, um, one where y your system is in place, um, you know, you feel like you, you have the ability to stop the run. And, and then on the perimeter, I think we're better um, than we were last year in a sense that we have, um, you know, the safety and, and the, the corner position has evolved. Um, so coming into the season when your special teams now is returning, uh, you feel really good about where you are. But, you know, you got to go play the games. And, and we were um, in a different place this year in terms of our preparation than when I made that comment in December. There were a lot of different things that have occurred. We didn't have spring practice, which I don't know that anybody's really going to be able to tell uh, what, what that does in terms of the effect of your football team, particular in these early games. I think the second thing is, you know, we didn't get all of our practices in, quite frankly. And, and I don't know who will. I mean, but there are those distractions that, that we had to, you know, obviously go through. Um, and, and other teams will have those same distractions. But my point being is those weren't in play um, in December. Uh, but the basic tenets of, of having a really good football team, potentially a great football team, are in place. And now we're going to have to go prove it.